Bukod sa mga pumanaw at mga nagkakasakit dahil sa pandemya, isa sa pinakamalaking epekto nito ay yung dagok sa ekonomiya. Maraming kumpanya, ang kung hindi pansamantalang nagsara, e tuluyang na bankrupt. Pero hindi naman lahat, negatibong naapektuhan nito. Isa na dyan ang industriya ng motorsiklo. Dumami lalo ang mga nagmamotor at gustong magmotor ngayon. Kaya yung mga kumpanya ng motor, kabilang sa mga bright spot, ika nga, ngayong may pandemya. Sa report nga mula sa Motorcycle Development Program Participants Association, bago magtapos ang 2021, tumaas pang overall motorcycle sales sa Pilipinas ng mahigit 50% kumpara noong 2020. Kabilang sa top 3 sa sales ang Yamaha Motor Philippines, na imbis na maghigpit ng sentro nitong may pandemya, ay lalo pang nag-expand. 2019 pa, nang simula ng Yamaha ang 2.7 billion pesos na expansion plan nila para sa kanilang Batangas plant at nagtuloy-tuloy ito noong pandemya. Kaya nasa bayan nila ang pagtaas ng demand sa kanilang mga scooter. The additional right now, especially is the 155, um, especially the, the NMAX right now, the, those motorcycles we try to produce is locally. And especially, um, everybody really wanted to upgrade into 155 displacement right now. So that's something as well that, we, that we, we've seen a long time ago and we wanted to, to step in when it comes to that kind of motorcycle. But the 125 will still have a great demand when it comes to um, the riding communities. Ayon sa Yamaha, kabaligtaran sa kanilang inaasahan yung naging reaksyon ng buyers ngayong may pandemya. One thing maybe is um, most of our customers right now is much more aggressive. They're really, if they want to have a motorcycle, they want it right now. That's a good thing about it. So, of course, as, as Yamaha, we always make sure that those motorcycles are always available in our Tria shops nationwide. So that when customer um, see us online, they would go to our Tria shop and make that motorcycle will be available for them. And that's uh, one of the biggest change right now when it comes to our customers. Right now, the game is everybody was is in automatic right now. So, scooters. Yeah, uh, we all know that Yamaha is pioneer when it comes to producing automatic motorcycles. And we keep the uh, owning a great culture when it comes to um, Yamaha Mios. So everybody is still looking forward to our motorcycles on how we keep the innovation, on how we keep the features that they, that they can use in everyday riding. And for them to have a great experience when it comes to riding motorcycle. Ang pagtaas ng sales nila naging daan para maituloy ng Yamaha ang paglalabas ng mga bagong modelo sa kabila ng mga restrictions dahil na nga sa COVID-19 virus. Ngayong taon, itinuloy nila ang launch ng bestseller nila na NMAX. At bagong models ng Mio scooters. Hindi rin nila ipinagpaliban yung paglabas ng bagong big bikes nila tulad ng adventure bike na Tenere 700 at 1200 na tumaas din daw ang demand. Tuloy-tuloy din ang naging suporta ng Yamaha sa Boy Wonder ng Philippine Racing na si McKinley Kyle Paz. Kahit nga mahirap mag-travel ngayon, nagawa pa rin ni Kyle na sumali sa FIM CEV Moto2 European Championship na ginawa sa Portugal at Spain. Yan ang unang beses na may Pinoy na nakasali sa patimpalak na itinuturing na stepping stone para sa mga rider na gustong makarating sa MotoGP. Kyle really have a great potential so when it comes to um, riding and racing because this guy He know how to race. He know how he needs to be responsible when it comes to riding. Because hindi lang naman yung basa sumakay ka ng motorcycle, but you have to be responsible and you have to inspire more people. For Kyle right now, our direction is for him this year to enjoy a lot and um, learn with all that kind of experience. And we're really looking forward that yeah, maybe soon we don't know Kyle will be the first ever again Filipino to be on the MotoGP at that young age. He really wants uh, what he do. So that's the good thing about him. He have a great passion when it comes to riding motorcycles. Pero higit sa pagtaas ng sales o pagpapatuloy ng mga marketing campaign, mas proud ang Yamaha na naipagpatuloy nila ang kanilang operasyon at pagbibigay ng trabaho sa marami nating kababayan. Yung naging expansion nila sa Batangas, nagbigay hanap buhay sa mahigit 1,500 na manggagawa. 
the management direction is uh, to keep everybody in the company. That's what's a good thing about it. That's why I think most of our employees of Yama are very much grateful with the management and how management are keeping. Even, even to the marketing group, we're, we're even adding more people to be part of, um, our, of our group as well. And I think we're, we're one of the lucky company. That's what the direction of the management are giving in everyone. And keeping everybody, especially pandemic, is really hard and tough for, for everybody. Matinding pagsubok man ng pandemia para sa lahat, meron pa ring mga positibong pangyayari na nagbibigay ng pag-asa. At patunay dyan ang patuloy na paglago ng industriya ng motorsiklo na nakakatulong hindi lang sa ating mga rider, kundi sa malaking bahagi ng ating lipunan.